Ego makes it hard to give someone advice slash feedback. If you can move past ego, right? Remember, it's there. You have to move past it. Um, it makes it easier on the feedback giver, right? So at the very top, in the upper right, um, the foundational program to decision making and leadership um, is called pre-resiliency training or PRT. What it's doing is attacking this upper right diagram. This is the individual in the middle. Say, imagine that's you. The red arrow behavior, which is what a rab is, a red arrow behavior is me putting out signals that creates this, um, you can't see it, but everyone can feel it, an invisible red barrier around me that basically says to you, do not give me feedback, mm -hmm. right? I do not want to hear any criticism for you, right? Like it's that C yeah. mindset that Nick Saban mentioned. I don't want you to judge me, criticize me. I don't want to hear it. Don't want to hear it. And people have different ways to do it, right? The simplest stuff that often comes out is, God, I worked so hard on this all night. The most important thing in the world in my life. I put so you much effort. You don't even have to say anything. Right? You could just look really hostile and angry. Right. And there or, 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 like, back, right? or, or the minute someone starts to give you feedback, you start crying and shaking, or you start foaming at the mouth. You're going to cut their heads off. Yeah, you know, a lot of people around pick up signals very quick and decide, don't go I don't there. think they want to hear from me, right? Mm -hmm. <laughs> um, and so that's what we call a red arrow behavior to recognize what it is that you do ever so automatically to dial down and start to disintegrate this red circle barrier is the key to be able to get truth.